right what we're gonna do is upgrade the antennas in the FSI 6 uh, transmitter so we're gonna have to take it apart you get these little connectors you put a little push on clip I don't know if you can see that and then to an SMA bolt attachment you know, two of them which I'll put the link in the description anyway and then I thought I'll double check and I'll put the link to these two these come as a set two Wi-Fi antennas 2.4 gig obviously um, and I'm sure they was 10 dBi but I will let you know but you can change from different ones I've got these two which I'm going to run most of the time and then I've ordered a 15 dBi massive antenna, so yeah, that one can go on there now and again when I'm at a really dodgy spot. But yeah, so pretty much, yeah, it's just a how to on. We're gonna have to drill the radio. I'm probably gonna fit them there first thing, take the batteries, back cover. Take your batteries out. Set inside. You've got one screw there, one screw there, two up top. Right, this should pull apart. Bit. Let's pull it apart slow because there's going to be wires attaching to your port on the back and the battery connectors so make sure you don't pull on them too hard and find it easier just to disconnect these then you can take the back off. So there, you've got one antenna pointing up in the middle, and then on the side, one in the handle pointing across the east. So, okay. We'll take this one out. <laughs> Literally runs down. You can follow the wire down, it comes down, clips onto the board. Put it there. Just plug it off. One's just underneath. Yeah. And then take the one out the top of your handle. Yeah, that's the two antennas removed. You gotta fit these into place. They'll you know, just clip straight on the way we just taken them off. One will run to there, and then one will run over to there. Where I do the drilling, just to push it back together. So if I had a look now behind, me. I know if I drill through, and <coughs> just not push the drill bit in far because it is buttons further back. side of the controller where you want the button. Start off with a small drill bit first I would. Drill a pilot roll and then move up to the bigger drill bit. And we just push on. So that's one. Okay. 
a little bit fiddly. Then clip them. Plug these wires back in. Pretty easy to follow. And got these, just got to tighten these nuts up. You won't need to crank them up really tight, so just do them up really slow. Just want them to move inside. Yeah. There we go. On each side. And because there's no antennas on this now, you don't want to power this on without your antennas on, so I'll make sure you've got these on there now. When you power it up. Then it'll give me the up which I had there and the across which I had there back in back and spares just in case anything you do have any problems you've always got your spare antennas then right, thanks for watching please like and subscribe There's plenty more content to come and let me know if you want me to cover anything thanks